I already paid off. Yeah. Those kills said I'm out. Yeah, one of those kills. I could have a quad feed. Yo, what up, it's your boy Bammy? You guys have a brand new video. And I thought I'd show you guys a sniper variant that I have been using here and there, and that is the Dragonov Plague Sword sniper variant. And it's very, very good. Like I said, I've been using the MK2 in car 98k a, a lot recently. Up, but this sniper right here is very, very fun to use. And I think it's a lot better. If you guys do not have this Dragonov variant, you guys should definitely go for right now because back then, I want to say two weeks ago, before all these updates, this Dragonov variant was very, very hard to go for. And I'm tell you why. And I'm gonna go through all the objectives on how you guys get this Dragonov variant yourself if you guys do not have it but it's very very fun it's very very good to use in my opinion and it looks very very nice as well but the first objective is to get 10 double kills obviously that is two rapid kills i would say that's much easier to do with this which is why they put it in objective one objective two would have to get five kills without dying 10 times obviously it's gonna get a lot harder as you go but eventually if you obviously just play right if you're more of a campy person and obviously you're gonna get it right away i'm a sniper myself so i just go on stream as much as i can i try to get my shot on i try to get the most kills that i can and at the time, this was obviously one of the harder ones just because my objective would go away and it would be hard to progress. But five kills without dying 10 times is objective two. Objective three is to get one triple kill and that's three rapid kills. Pretty self-explanatory as well as I do recommend you guys go to hardpoint, domination, headquarters, all those objective game modes will give you a better opportunity to get you a rapid kill medal. Objective four would have to be the opposite objective two and that is 10 kills without dying five times. Now this obviously is a lot harder. You obviously want to play a lot better you want to play passive maybe here and there you have camp just a little bit i think around this time is when it started to get just a little bit harder i'm over a sniper like i said myself so obviously i'm sniping the whole time and i got 10 kills without dying five times objective number five would have to be three fury kills and that's four rapid kills now like i said before i would definitely recommend you guys going to a hard point domination headquarters so you guys are actually streaks if you guys actually do well when going for this i do recommend using your kill streaks, maybe a predator missile, maybe a chopper gunner, maybe a harrier to help you get these rapid kills because those obviously do count for this objective. Number six, we have to be 15 kills without dying just one time. And this one definitely was a lot harder. When I'm sniping, I don't really like going for streaks as much. I just like getting as most kills as I can. I'm very, very aggressive. I just run out and try to get the most clips that I can. But 15 kills without dying, you do have to play passive a lot. I would recommend going to 10v10 maybe. Or if you're going to 6v6, I just find those maps that are good for you that fit your play style. But 10v10, I think that is what helped me out a lot in the 15 kills without dying. And lastly, objective number seven is just all you gotta do is get one quaffy medal. That is four uninterrupted kills in the kill feed. And trust me when I tell you this is not the easiest just because you have to get it pretty quick. You have to get the quaffy medal. You can't just get it a quad feed and then it's gonna count you kind of have to get it pretty quick kill streaks do count so i do recommend you guys go for kill streaks use a chopper gunner use a harrier and obviously play those game modes the objective game modes that help you and will help and obviously play those game modes those objective game modes that will help you get this objective a lot more i don't recommend ground war and maybe 10v10 will be a little bit harder 6v6 i got in a lot of quad feed medals but at the same time i did get this actual objective in 10v10 so i'd say 10v10 6v6 are the ones that you're gonna want to do. Objective game modes will help you a lot, and ground war is a no-go. Now I'm gonna talk to you guys on now I'm gonna talk to you guys on the class setup that I have on the Dragonov as of right now. If you guys want to go through here, I have the 510 millimeter compact barrel on the Dragonov. I have the tack laser, and I'm pretty sure my base cam is covering over it, but I have the stock F Pack Stalker Scout. I have sleight of hand for my Dragonov, and I have a 20 round magazine. Now you don't have to have extended mags. This gun already has 10 bullets in it. 
I just have 20 magazines because I just felt like I didn't want to reload. I'm a more aggressive player. I don't really like reloading, sitting and waiting and all that stuff. But it does actually decrease your aim and speed if you put on ecstatic mags. So it's up to you if you want it. I don't really mind that much because I can't really tell that much of a difference, but I do have it on because I can still see myself using it. Now I'm gonna show you guys a gameplay of what I got with this Dragon Up Plague Soar. Hopefully you guys enjoy the rest of the video. I'll have highlights after that just because all the highlights after that highlights from my stream highlights i got off stream using mk2 using the car and obviously the dragon up play store so hopefully you guys enjoy the video hopefully you guys enjoy that clip in the beginning and make sure you guys like subscribe all that stuff i'm also live right now if you guys want to come check i'm also live right now if you guys want to come check me out and i'll catch you guys in the next one much love do see it peace out people Oh, let me go, let me go. Why? Marker, dude, I sprayed like the last couple shots, but dude, that was actually so nice. I jump shot at one guy. <laughs> Yo, that was a three piece on the victory. That's funny. Here, this is it right here. Wait, and then jump that guy, and then I had to spray that last guy. That was so nice. He was kind of running away. Bro, we came back on these kids. What the, the fuck? Bro, yeah, that was fucking insane, dude. Yeah, that was actually crazy. Ellie. Yelling, fucking baby crying. Yeah, yeah, that's all we heard, bro. We was like, what the fuck? Yeah, bro, we're trying to just play BO4. What the fuck is happening right now? Wait, I think I remember that. Bro, I literally looked in that direction. What the fuck? Let me go, let me go, let me go. Where are they? Oh my god. How you go, man? Fucking Fuck me! You fucking slime bag! Go, <laughs> <laughs> Ben, what? Um, nice. So funny luck. Damn, all those kills just went off the screen. I know. I know. That is crazy to me. Wait, did they do it to you too? Yes, that's crazy to me, bro. <laughs> oh, let me go, let me go, let me go. Okay, Ben. Under the scaffold, under the scaffold. What the fuck does that mean? What does that mean? <laughs> you know what a scaffold is, bro? Bro, I still got it. That was actually funny. <laughs> really? Yeah, I was split. But... Please spawn here.
Dude, he killed me off those infinite swap. <laughs> oh my god, bro. I don't even know if that would have been infinite swap, bro. Look at the way that I floss. Yeah. Shorty say that I'm a boss. Uh, and they know I got a sauce. What? You don't want me, that's your loss. Yeah. And my wrist be on frost. Yeah. I be dripping like a boss. Yeah. Wanna come turn out with us.